In this video, let us continue to solve more problems based on trigonometric ratios of compound angles. And here we've got a problem. It reads like this. If a plus b equals pi by 4, prove that 1 plus tan a into 1 plus tan b equals 2. So now where do you get tan suddenly, you know, in a plus b equals pi by 4? So you first write a plus b equals pi by 4. Now if you do not have tan, you know, you need tan here to prove that. So apply tan on both sides. So it becomes tan of a plus b equals tan of pi by 4, right? So tan of a plus b is nothing but tan a plus tan b divided by 1 minus tan a tan b. And you know that tan pi by 4, which is tan 45 degrees, is equal to 1. So you can write this as tan a plus tan b equal to 1 minus tan a tan b. This goes to the right to the right hand side gets multiplied with 1 and becomes 1 minus tan a into tan b. So now you write tan a plus tan b, get this to the left hand side, write plus tan a tan b equals 1, but we need 2 on the right hand side, right? So yeah, what we'll do now is let us add 1 to both the sides, okay? Adding 1 to both the sides we will have 1 plus tan A plus tan B plus tan A times tan B. And you add 1 to the right hand side as well. So it becomes 1 plus 1 equals 2, right? So now taking out 1 plus tan A, rather grouping it, just write 1 plus tan A here. And then since these two terms have got tan B and tan B, take out tan B and you have 1 plus tan A right which is equal to 2 so now take out 1 plus tan a this is one term if you see carefully and this is one term if you see both these terms 1 plus tan a is the same in both the terms so take out 1 plus tan a and you get 1 plus tan a in the place of 1 plus tan a you write 1 so it becomes 1 plus tan b right equals 2 so here we have so you just have to use a bracket that's all 1 plus tan a into 1 plus tan b equals 2 and we've got the rhs whatever that is i mean the entire thing so that's all we have to do here so don't worry if the trigonometric ratio is not there in the given question or the equation you just have to sometimes apply it like how you apply log on both sides to solve a problem so here since you need a tan just apply tan on both the sides and then proceed from there and yeah of course you know adding one to both sides and all those things it's not really natural but you're going to get there as you practice the same problems more and more you're going to know okay right for this problem i got to add one somewhere so that's how you get that instinct to add one on both the sides. All right, so that ends this uh, problem as well as video. I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with more problems based on trigonometric ratios of compound angles.